Okay, guys, um, just looking at this, having a flick over, it's the hourly is just say pushing over, it's pushing into the golden eye five minute. I th see it's the pushing the top of here, could be an opportunity for a quick trade. So we'll just quickly bang an order in, boom. And we're going to put it on the top of golden eye, just like so. That'll do. Just into the mid range. Why? It's broke. It's pushing through. Bang, bang. I'm going to alter the MACD on the hour. And as I did so. It told me to scalp it okay so what happened change the dynamic slightly so it then went to scalp this became a buy and the anchor became a buy now I waited sort of 15 minutes to see what happened and I just readdressed I looked at that first but I wanted to see what the effect was on the hour I wouldn't normally do it, but it's sort of 20 past eight, so there's quite a lot of um, volatility kicking around. And it pushed it through, because it was sitting neutral. I wanted to see whether it was buying or selling on the hour. Just pull this back, so we can see what the situation is. And then we'll watch it. Now, hopefully this will pop relatively quickly. That's the plan. Or at least I hope so. It is stretched quite high, so that could create a problem. Bugger. Just um, switch that off. Put that back over there. But it is pushing heavily, so I don't really want to push my luck. So we'll see what the score is, what it's looking for. It's looking for nine pips. Okay. So we're going to measure that in now. So I want to get it to approximately here. What do I do if it's wrong? Well, it can run all the way down to this swing point. So I've got a barrier here and I've got a barrier there. So if I'm going to madness into this, last point of entry be top of that golden eye onto here. So there'll be another entry in and around there. I'll just drop that in while we having a little bit of a think. Drop that there. Sort that out. Okay. So just move that into place. Put that in the same area. Okay, cool. So I'm happy with that box of pain would be under here would be there don't really want it to go beyond that point just drop that into there already kind of know that I'm probably okay there's my 50% up to there that's down onto there so it's a shade under one to one but it is a scalp so i'll have to be careful so i want to keep this relatively tight and we'll just play it out see if it'll pick that up pick that up and get out up here and then we'll get a few quid that's the game that's what we looking to achieve now come on come on little bit a little bit okay i'll let it run for half an hour see what see what happens
Okay guys, I've just done an evaluation. Um, we're still buying on a 15 minute, but we've gone back to neutral. It's telling me it's not ready. So all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna manage this out because there's no trade in it at all. So what I want to do is I'm now gonna use the madness just once it gets into a positive situation, I'll start looking to get out of this trade. And I think that's the sensible thing to do at this moment in time. So that's coming in here. Um, I'll just watch it just a second. I'll just watch the hourly as well. Okay. So it's about 60 quid against me at the moment. Not overly too worried because I'm staying within the three madness points. But I genuinely have to think about getting out of this. Now, there is another way I can do it. I can actually close off this one here. Just shut it, take the money but then put an order back in where it is. And the method behind that is, well, if it's coming down to take it out of the equation, you might as well have your money and place the order back in, nice and simple. So you just drop that back to there, let it pick it back up and then go up. But in the meantime, look to get out of these two. So that'll drop a little bit of money in. Uh, I kind of did it yesterday. Similar situation where you, you kill. So it's 43 quid in the job. And that's it. So again, it's just about managing your trades and your expectations. Now, I'll watch this. I've, I've got to go out this morning. Because um, as I say, I've got to go to a hotel to see a, a room. Um, but we'll see how this goes for maybe the next hour or so. Okay, catch you in a bit. Okay guys, that's it managed out trade is complete and that's given me a half decent profit there you are so that's like 106 107 quid uh over the course of the last hour and all i've done is i've just followed my rules slowly slowly changed dynamic look to manage out and then i'll just reset that's it that's all trading is it's just management 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 every time and as soon as you see that it's right just get out um, and that's all I do all day um, well not all day I'm actually done for the day now finished happy days catch you soon <laughs>